Hello, my wonderful fans and followers. So today I have um, two uh, products I'm gonna do videos on that I picked up today because of my awesome mom. And uh, yeah, so one of the items that uh, one of them it took that I can't figure out how to work yet, so I might wait on that video a bit longer, but. For now, I got this thing. This pumpkin right here that is very interesting. It's a Bluetooth pumpkin. Um, I don't know why Menards, because that's exactly where I got it. Menards was selling these, but I got this for like $20 at Menards. $20. So that's what it looks like. You can use, uh, it looks like um, you can use your phone or tablet to actually hook it in. You can also use a, a USB um, plug-in as well for, for the audio, which is kind of neat. So, um, and it looks like uh, the lights will dance to the music and um, you can turn off the light if you don't want it on, and you can just have the music. Uh, works for any smartphone or devices, so we're just gonna open this up as my cat walks around the corner here. So, I'm actually gonna use this as a case for this. It's, it's like a normal jack-o'-lantern. Um, plastic, obviously. Um, inside here, I can reach pretty far back in there. That's where all the LEDs are, I'm sure. There's the speakers, which are in the back. There's your, um, plug-in to charge it, plug-in for, uh, your phone or device that you want to plug in, so like an iPod if, if it won't connect. This is to change, uh, the light, and that's to turn it on. Sadly, I'm not going to play any music, but I might play a video of uh, my YouTube stuff. Uh, just because I can, and that way it doesn't get copyrighted. So, yeah, let's uh, turn it on, and uh, I'll put it on the table, and we'll take a look at it. I got my lava lamp back up and running. I'm pretty proud of that. And my awesome rock over there, my light rock. So, and a fan, because it gets hot in here. But yeah, so let's go turn this baby on and uh, see just how good it is. My girlfriend's probably going to kill me because she's sleeping right now. <laughs> okay, so we're going to turn this baby on. So here we go. Little thing. Ooh. Letting you know that it's on, obviously. I'm actually going to turn off the light so you can see the light better. Ooh, spooky. So, and then the light, you can just have it not flicker. Uh, I think it's waiting for music right now, but and you can have it turned off. So, without further ado, um, you just go into... See if I can get my Bluetooth to work. Here we go. So you just go obviously into your Bluetooth, find the name of it, which right here is the name. Yours might be different than mine, but that is what mine is named. And uh, pretty sure I have the volume all the way up. I do. So let's go, um, let's find a uh, my intro video to my YouTube channel. Um, like I said, my girlfriend's probably gonna kill me. Um, but here we go. They can take your world. They can take your heart. Cut you loose from all you know. Sounds pretty good to me. But if it's your fate, then every step forward 
will always be a step closer to home. Like, it's wiggling my table. Bass is really awesome. Okay, so that's enough of that. I'm not going to play too much of it, otherwise I might get in trouble. But, anyways, um, I picked, I managed to get it for like $20. Let me turn on the light. I was lucky and managed to get this baby for like $20. Um, I will say it's uh, really useful to possibly, you know, carry it around as you're trick-or-treating and there's your Halloween music on there, you know. Um, it's really awesome and even if you can't Bluetooth it, you can plug a cord into it and pl or, uh, plug a cord into the the jack-o'-lantern itself and have it play. So um, this is great for people like me who like to play spooky music on their uh, on their deck and like to give out candy because I like to give out candy during Halloween. Um, so I have this wonderful thing. But if you guys can find it online, that's wonderful. I managed to find mine at Menards uh, for like twenty dollars. Uh, they still have quite a few of them there, but. Uh, yeah, I'll have this jack-o'-lantern and my other um, light bulb jack-o'-lantern, which actually looks uh, pretty much the same. So yeah, um, I know this is a kind of a Halloween decoration, but it's an interesting speaker. I have another uh, speaker that uh, I'll be maybe doing a, a review on as well. I don't have the box for it though, sadly. This one I got lucky because the other uh, speaker I bought in California. Oh, no, no, Shush, phone. Good gravy. But uh, yeah, so I would definitely pick one up, even if you're uh, one of the. If you want to put it on your deck, uh, or put it in a window for Halloween, or just plain old carry it around. It's it's not super heavy, like. The speaker itself, I think, is the heaviest part, but it, it, in general, it's really not that heavy. Super light. It's got a bit of weight to it, but not like massive weight. Like, yeah. So yeah, that's uh, the jack o lantern speaker. Thought uh, you might be interested in... I don't know, it's been a while since I've done technology and review on stuff. I thought why not review this jack-o'-lantern that's really, really cool? When am I going to be able to uh, promote something interesting, which, you know, they're not paying me. I just decided to do this for fun. Um, so good luck finding it, and uh, enjoy your jack-o'-lantern when you get one, if you do decide to get one. And uh, like I said, it sounds pretty awesome. I like it from what music clip I was able to give to you. So, I'm your host, Kibali Kairi 2010. Thank you guys so much for um, checking out my channel on closest to Halloween or whenever I decide to post this video. Probably somewhere in October. <laughs> so, hoping you're having a wonderful holiday. And uh, who knows, maybe I might do some uh, pumpkin carving stuff and whatnot. So, uh, we went uh, thrift shopping for. Fourth of July stuff. So, yeah. Super excited. A scattered dream that's like a far off memory. A far off memory that's like a scattered dream. I want to line the pieces up. Yours and mine.